hi guys welcome back to my channel and today I'm gonna show you why people like Amazon merch and how to get accepted in Amazon merch program very fast like I did a couple months ago so let me begin with telling you what Amazon merch is actually the program called merch by Amazon uh, this is a print on demand program that Amazon launched a few years back where designers and just regular people who know how to use software designing shirts you know these shirts that everyone is wearing with logos with some sort of the slogans on it you do not have to have some designer skills to do so you just need to use a software of some kind you can even use some free software like canva or paint.net if you need the software i will leave uh, um, links below this video those two programs are completely free and can be downloaded from internet at any time so um Amazon by Merch is very easy to make money on because it's actually the only way of passive income I know for right now. This is where you just download your design, you write a small description of what is short is about and who it will suit the most and that's it you upload this design and you wait until it's live so basically you can upload design and it could be sold like 800 times without you doing anything else by just waiting for your money to come back to your account so how to get to the Amazon merch how to register and get accepted recently a lot of people have been reporting that people will um, are denied for no reason so today I'm going to show you how to register on Amazon merch so you can get accepted you can be from US or non US citizen and you will still be able to sell online if you fill out all the stuff online correctly so let's hop on on my computer and I will show you right now what you can do to get accepted okay so now we in my computer and we just go simply to merch that amazon.com and this is going to bring us to the main page of this um, Amazon part we're going to scroll down and we're going to search for yellow button which says request invitation so just click on it real quick and it's going to bring us to the next page and going to tell you exactly what do you need in order to sign up this is why a lot of people are complaining that they get rejected because most of these parts either not filled out correctly or not in full and because most of it actually um, read by computer not you know person by machine if something is blank or not fully um, filled out you might get rejected so let's just try to read what do we need in order to apply for this gig so merge by Amazon asks you to have a business contact information do not let this scare you because you might also apply if you as individual you do not have to have a legit business in order to apply for it um, the second one is bank account and routing number for your bank you do have to have a bank it does not matter which country the bank is um, at but you do need to have bank information in order to receive your payments in this uh, case PayPal won't work so number three it's social security number or other tax identification number so if you are located in us and you are the citizen of us you must provide your social security number and you will receive a your 1099 form at the end of the year and also you will be withhold 30 percent of the tax but for other nationalities in other countries you must provide other identification number I will explain why later in this video. Also, if you did not give this video a thumbs up yet, please do so now and subscribe for more knowledge. I'm trying to put the best videos for you guys and this is definitely one of those videos where everyone should try to apply for it. If you do know how to use the software I talked about, uh, the links are below again, you must apply for it. it very easy to do and it's stable 
income if you are doing everything correctly and even with simple designs you might get a lot of a lot of sales so let's begin application after we click on it we're going to select our country and in this case let's say i'm going to just select canada for example you're going to fill out all of this information real quick it's going to ask you for your name your address in your postal code and phone number also business email address i do recommend that you get a us number if you do not know how to get there uh, please leave your comment below and i will try to help you to do so you will just need to have a wi-fi for that it's completely free too also business email address um, again i do recommend that it has extension.com .net and like Yahoo, Gmail, or something else, easy recognizable for machine to read. And it could be just your email address, you will be receiving your um, notifications and payment information too. Also, you will need to select the bank. You need to select the United States and in which currency you will be paid or Canada. Um, fill out this all information. When you're gonna open up a bank account, you will be given a paper with all of this information so it's so easy just to copy and paste here everything which you're going to be given or just type it up you know so i hope it's very clear until this point um let's recap it a little bit you do not have to have a business you can provide your own name and you will have to provide your um, phone number and also bank information be sure to type it very correctly from the first time so you don't have to have it later and after you just go to add since i don't have it i cannot click it but then you will be going to the next section which is tax status again as i, I mentioned a little bit already um, you will have to complete this tax information interview on the next page and it is crucial you do fill out everything correctly here so if you do apply as an individual make sure to select individual and also if you do have a business you apply in business um, if you do have LLC apparently you do have to select an individual and you will still receive the 99 at the end of the year again for the next one it's um, for US tax purposes are you US person what US person means so if you do live in us you us citizen or green card holder you do have to select yes if you live outside of us you select no if you do select no they will be asking you if you act in as an uh, intermediary agent and you will say no this is going to bring you on the next one so you will fill out your tax and identity information you do this all as um, whatever country from like you selected Canada for example and just fill it out make sure it's correct because this is where you're going to receive your tax and tax form or whatever at the end of the year and also you have to leave your number in the next section so if you US citizen you leave your social security or EIN number but if you outside of us you just leave TIN number so TIN number what's TIN number it's identification number or national um, national number national insurance number I believe so when you were born you've been given a give uh, I'm sorry birth certificate and it came actually with um, number tax number that your country knows that you have to pay taxes basically and they assign you a number so this is what you're gonna enter here if you do not have it actually you can just uncheck it and see it's gonna you know it's gonna give you some options on what can you do and it's a little bit you know I don't know it's a little bit tricky i do recommend you to get the number before you apply because in this case you might get rejected really quick and i think the most people got rejected from this program 
might be because of that, because they don't provide enough information. And when machine reads all of this, something is missing and they reject you automatically. So the only last step left is sign and submit. You will have to read all the rules. Unfortunately, I cannot continue because I have a lot of things to fill up. Let me try just to do this real quick and see. It didn't work. <laughs> okay, so you will see that you just need to click sign and submit. So in a couple of days, um, probably you will receive something in your mail saying if you got accepted or not. It is um, easy to check also on the same website. You can sign in and see what the status of your application is. You just go here and my account and it's going to show you here. So also as a bonus to this video, I did want to show you what exactly is uh, shirts you are sure is that you will be designing. Those are simple shirts that, you know, have just some tagline and simple designs on it. I have a little extra like this, for example, and other ones. If you are interested in this topic, I will be more than happy film more videos about uh, merged by Amazon because I think it's very good program. It's passive income one. It's easy to make two and you do not need to have a special skills to design anything. People are buying, you know, Amazon is huge and if you even get one design, eventually it will sell. So let, let's just finish this video with saying I wish you uh, all the best and if you got accepted just leave your comment below and if you have any questions or requests about this video or other videos um, please just you know again drop me a comment like this video subscribe to my channel and check out other videos about how to make money on Amazon I will see you next Tuesday with how to with Sue thank you and bye